The next part that we're going to create is this base rod. This base rod is very similar to pin one and pin two. It's a, it's a simple cylinder. So we'll go into inventor. We still have our lifter arm up. We'll just simply close the lifter arm. We'll click on the new button once again. Standard inch IPT file, inventor part file. Click on OK. And we begin by using that circle command. Click for the center of the circle. Move your mouse out. Click to define the diameter of the circle. We simply use our dimension tool and we click on the edge of the circle, drag our dimension out to edit the dimension. We simply click on the listed dimension. In this case, it's listed at 0.427. We want to change that to 0.25. Click on the green arrow and we are finished sketching. Click on the finish sketch button up in the top right hand corner. Once again, I am going to put, place this in a nice symmetric view by clicking on the little home icon in the view cube. I'm going to zoom out a little bit, make my way to the create extrude tool. It finds the profile and we need to define the distance of the extrusion. In this case, it's 6.25. Click on OK, I'll zoom out, pan it to the center, and we've now created the base rod. We make our way to the Save button, and we'll call it Base Rod. In that case, I type Base Bod, but we'll correct that. 